Hello, darlings, and welcome to another Let's Build New Crest. <laughs> that was lovely. I would say that was an F sharp or an E flat, and I'm here for both of them. Welcome. Welcome, my friends. Welcome back. Park Lane Apartments. We are going to be finishing the Bond residence today, my ladies and my gentlemen and my non-binary friends. We are going to be getting it sorted. We're going to do a few other things as well. We're going to keep this episode rolling because I do want to do a laundry room. So I saw a comment um, about said laundry room, about doing it in this episode. I thought that was a great idea. Loved it. About those comments. What's he doing? Oh! <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that was Hector. That was stunning. That was so good. It was really like, you know, I was here for that. <laughs> oh, I had to get a glitch in, didn't I? Well, I'm there for it. I really am. <laughs> Sorry about my laugh. It's not like Adele. Anyway, today we're going to be finishing off Hector's room. Also, the bathroom we've got to do. And then we're going to be going downstairs into the basement and we're going to be doing a laundry room. And I might see if we can slip a couple of saunas down there. I, I'm feeling a sauna coming on for this place. And maybe like a, a work cupboard as well where they could have um, stuff for cleaning, like for the cleaners. And yeah, I would imagine this place is fully staffed with cleaners as well that come in and clean the apartments. Um, yeah, I would definitely say it. But look at the look at this queen. Oh, we don't want to see your kebab, darling. Look at Barbara living her best bloody life. Full diamond and ruby earrings by the pool, if you will. There for that. I need to turn off that fame shine because it gets on my tits. And um, he is quite hot, isn't he? He is quite hot. He was he was really hot when he glitched out just a minute ago. I was oh loved it. <laughs> um yeah, cool. Okay, let's start. Let's get in. Let's get in. Let's do it. So these are the areas that we're going to be getting done today. Obviously, all the balcony and outside areas, including the back garden, Hector's room, the bathroom, and then we'll go down into the basement and do the laundry room and stuff as well. Um, I did say last time that I'd introduce you to the next characters. I'm going to leave it, actually. Can we help you? Look at them all. Coming over from Council Block. Look, what are you doing out in the sun? You will burn yourself to a crisp, my love. Got Robert here. No idea who that is. Doesn't look very pleased to be here. And Annalise with one of those awful fruitcakes. I don't know why. Don't know why they feel it's the need to come over with a fruitcake. Is that a thing? Does that happen in America or places where i'm not sure uh but yeah i didn't put any portraits up yet i haven't took them but i'm gonna take one of your guys idea you said take a photo of barbara when she was younger and put the her younger portraits up there i love that idea so we're going to do that yes and i also got rid of the four chairs from here it was just too squished and put two there and then i saw somebody else comment that so i was like oh yeah so someone else is thinking along the same lines as me as well but um but yes, here we are. Um, someone said to move the... I kind of liked that idea as well. I think we're going to try that. Someone said to move the bookcase here. I didn't try that off of camera. And put the door here. Yep, yeah, I'm there for that. That's a good idea as well. Thank you, my love, whoever that was. I'm sorry I couldn't find your comment. And I will get to those comments, guys. My God, I got so many comments yesterday. I was overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. But I really appreciate them. I really do. Thank you. Thank you for believing in a gay like me. <laughs> anyway, do we want him to have that colour in there? I'm obviously going to be putting wallpapers on in here. Maybe we could make this a little bit more fresh. A little bit more modern. I would see him being a little bit more on the modern side compared to Barb. And Barb gave him free reign to do whatever the hell he may wish with his room. And it's quite a nice substantial size as well, so... Let's have a little think, shall we? Let's have a think. Um, you'll be pleased to know you will not be getting overexposed Aiden for much longer. <laughs> my, I ordered my camera, so it's on its way. It is coming. 
I've still got to get something else to go with the camera. And at the minute, they're all out of stock. So I don't know how long it's going to be until they are back in stock. So you might be getting overexposed, Aiden, for a little bit longer. Who can say? Who can say? That's the question. Um, What about this one? Ooh, I always use grey. Let's try and... Let's try... Ooh, mix things up a bit. Ugh, God, that's disgusting. Mix things up a bit with a white. <laughs> um, maybe we could do an accent wall. We'll do an accent wall in here for him. I wouldn't imagine he's being very... He's much up to date with things. I would imagine he's just a little bit back back in time, shall we say. But to the point where it's not kind of like Barbara's tastes. Hmm. I kind of preferred it in the grey. So maybe if I use that one actually in the grey. Let's have a look. Yeah. It needs to be warmer. It needs to be warmer for the main reasons that this flat... This apartment is a bit warm. So I'm going to try maybe mix up a, like a, a nice tone just to get... Oh, oh, that's not too bad actually. And that's still modern. That's still modern. And then maybe we can go quite kind of fresher and lighter with the furniture and stuff. Let's try that. We've also got to remember to get a piano in here. I'm going to do a grand piano as well out on the decking somewhere. Like maybe around here. I thought that would be a nice touch. And I might even put like a canopy over the top. Just so it looks like that it couldn't get wet. I'm there for that idea. I really am. So we're going to do it. It's happening. We're doing it. Anyway, on to the beds. Double bed. Because Hector would be wishing he could bring somebody home. So he would always leave space on one side. For the love that he is missing. <laughs> I keep spitting. I don't understand what it is. I hope I don't do that in like to my friends or like people I talk to. <laughs> but spit all over them. <laughs> uh, they're probably like. I've actually got a funny story about uh, spitting. If you'd like to hear it. I'm sure you will. So I'm going to tell it. Um, that's quite a nice bed tone in here. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. Yeah, I kind of like that because it's bringing in that salmon tone again from the apartment. Yes, I think I'm going to put the bed up on this wall. So we've got more space around here to do stuff with. Let's do that. Anyway, spitting story. Um, It was with an ex-boyfriend. That sounds wrong. It's not. We're not going to go down that route, by the way, with spitting. <laughs> <laughs> Me and my ex were in a shop once. And this man behind the counter was... Um, just speaking, doing the polite thing and talking, but he was eating a pack of peanuts at the same time. <laughs> and, um, the man said something to my ex and with that, when he said something, a bit of peanut flew out of his mouth and stuck to my ex's cheek, like there. And because my ex was too polite to say anything, <laughs> he carried on talking to him. For about five minutes afterwards, with this big bit of peanut stuck to his cheek. And at that point, I had to leave the shop because I was laughing. Like, under my breath, laughing. Um, and he came out the shop with the peanut in question still stuck to his cheek. And just went... <laughs> I was like, I know, I, I had to leave. I had to leave. It was too funny. It was too funny. Yeah, maybe using these, we could go maybe a little bit more mid-century with some of his furniture. That could be quite cute. Let's try this. Oh, this is going to be a squeeze, isn't it? This is going to be a little bit of a squeeze, my loves. But we're going to make it work. It's going to happen. And we're all going to be 100% here for it. That's all we can say. All we can say. I can't wait to edit this later and see that glitch again with Hector bending around by the pool. I'm going to piss myself again. I can feel it coming on. Right. Now that I've got those in, I'm going to make some accent walls in white. Just, oh, just here. And just here by the actual blind itself. I remember I used to be all about doing these little, like, accent, like, stripes on the walls, like, years ago. 
I used to love doing that. Loved it. I got that tip from Delhi, actually. I used to... Not that I'm not still obsessed with her. I used to watch every single video. Um, but now I just don't have the time. And that's the sad thing. Once you turn into a creator yourself, it's it's hard to get around and watch everybody's speed builds and stuff and videos and content. Um, and I never thought it would get that way. I didn't. I always thought I would be, be able to watch everybody's content, you know. But I can't. I'm only one man, for goodness sake. Okay. So we need a couple of lamps here, but I'm thinking about just doing a couple of like table like reading like these. Or maybe I could just do one and put a, like a, some flowers over there. Let's try that. What color should we do here? I forgot that they all come in a bit shit color choices. That's not too bad. That is not too bad at all. Nice little pop of orange there and then we'll do a nice... A nice plant. Oh, yeah, maybe this one. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's absolutely gorgeous, that. Um, and above here, <gasps> where are those, like, memorabilia things from again? They're from Get Famous, I think. Get Famous. Maybe they're on there. Yeah, these. Maybe we could get, like, a musician one. I know that they've got a few guitars. Yeah. God, that's very dominating, isn't it? If I turn that down, is that guitar too big, small for a sim? It kind of is. But I'm kind of thinking I'm going to go with it. What was the other one? The electric guitar. Yeah, that one's a bit better. Oh, I do like that. I do, my loves. I bloody do. Um, And then maybe putting a nice, that little hangy plant here. Just there. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's ever so nice, that. And maybe we could do like a a gallery wall there. With like photos of him with some of the artists that he's collabed with or something. I don't know. But I'm going to stick up a few musician-y ones. I think the only musician-like ones we've got are those base game jazz ones. And I don't think they'll go in here. No, they won't. They're awful. They're bloody disgusting. This one here will, though. If I can... Oh, I thought he didn't have any swatches then. I was going to say, what the hell? Um, it's very classic looking though, isn't it? I don't want it to be so classic looking. Oh, the choices that we've got. Oh, this one's is lovely. This one could work. I like that uh, gold frame in here as well. Yeah, one of his favourite jazz musicians. Cornelius Mont. Gomery Burns. <laughs> Who's that again? Oh, that's um, Mr. Burns, isn't it? From The Simpsons. So we can't use that. For fear of copyright claimage. Absolutely cannot use that. I'm sorry, my loves, but it's already been taken. Um, I'm just going to stick with that one for the minute. And I'm just going to concentrate on where we're going to get everything else. Because I do want a keyboard here. Uh, I'm thinking about doing the keyboard... Oh, it would be better here, actually, by the doors. And then we can do the, his clothing and dresses along here. And maybe just a little armchair in the middle or something. Yes. Feeling a rug in this room as well. We'll flop a rug in somewhere. So what we were going to do, we were going to go into activities and skills. Into, the, into here and get a keyboard out. Once again, not having cheats on. It's going to be okay, because as soon as I've stretched... As soon as I've set up my... um stream deck again i'll put all my sims 4 cheats on my stream deck and uh it'll be a lot easier just doing that than having to remember to put in the cheats every time such a silly bum i know where are you keyboard oh there you are um mm, i'm thinking about just having a plain gray one that would be fine yes is that the right spot for it there? I think maybe it could come even closer here. Yes. Um, a microphone as well. I would imagine he had I would imagine Hector's got a good singing voice. He's like a he's got a really like, I don't know, husky, like baritone voice. It doesn't suit him. So maybe that's one. Right, I'm gonna get these sheets on. One second. There we go. I just got out a basic microphone stand, a nice little guitar here. 
And I'm thinking of doing a big mirror here. Maybe he practices all the time and likes to watch himself sing and perform. Just to try and perfect his craft. That could be a good idea. Do we want to do three big ones? I mean, that doesn't look too bad. Or should we do a bit more of a classic framed mirror? There's not going to be many. No, there's not going to be any. Sorry. Oh, actually, what about the... Yeah, these ones. I could use. I could do these in the white. Oh, that's better. Yes, 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 yes. Absolutely. Can you overlap these? I think you can. Yeah, you can. There we go. Well, let's perfect this because I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying the lines that that has given. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yes, that's that's the ticket right there. Right there, my love. We're going to bring you to about there, actually. Bring you to about there. Oh, a little creative space. Stunning, stunning. Yes, yes. So, now for some more pictures. I'm wondering if I can find any decent um, musician ones. I don't think we can. I don't think we can. I'm just going to have a look. Now, with my looking, I couldn't really find any. So I've just put this down just to act as some of his songwriting awards. I might actually go into debug in a second. Maybe, maybe get a couple of those Grammy looking ones. There we go. A little trophy cabinet for Hector. These are his free Grammy war awards that he won for doing an advert jingle for hemorrhoids and that is the tea <laughs> and that is where we're going with that one my loves i think that's i think that's a beautiful storyline i mean who does not like a jingle for hemorrhoids that's all i can say that's all i can say on it all i can say <laughs> mm, i would Probably see him having in a bit more of a substantial wardrobe. Can I, like, do a... No. No, you cannot, Aiden. Um, maybe... Maybe using these in a bit more of a, a lighter tone. I could do them in white. No, that doesn't look right in here. Doesn't look right. Looks weird. And we're not for it. That wasn't too bad, really, was it? No, it's not, actually. It's quite good. Well, there we are. That is uh, going to be the ticket. We'll whiff it into the wall, though, because that is very, very far away. <clears throat> and a dresser. Can we get a dresser there? We definitely can. Do they have a matching dresser to that? Oh, yeah, they do. It's this one, though. I mean, I could, because I could put that maybe next to the... No. Like there. And then get a mirror with the lights around it. Without the photos on the frame, please. Um, I was kind of there for that salmon-y moment then. I won't lie. Is that supposed to be rose gold? I think it is. Yeah, that goes in here nicely. We'll pop you there. Oh, yes. Absolutely. Yes, I do believe so. And I think I'm going to do a little small bookcase in here. Maybe he likes to... Have his own space so he can read and whatnot. I'm feeling it. Maybe just using the wall one there. Uh, or this one. Oh, no, that's very large. I didn't realise how large you were. No, that doesn't suit here. I think this one here, just in... I know that's a bit more orangey, but I think that's going to be the ticket. Oh, no, that one there. Lovely. There we are. Stunning there. Absolutely. Um, Up here, I'm going to... Maybe, let's have a look. What can we put here? What can we whiffle in this little bit? Um, oh, he would need a stereo in here, definitely. Will we be able to get stereo up there? I would imagine him having a bit more of a bigger stereo, though, than one that would go up there, considering he's a, a music lover and whatnot. So maybe one of the taller ones. Oh, he would have an old-fashioned one, wouldn't he? Oh, I love that in here. Oh, what can we do? Hmm. <laughs> That's very large and it's not going to fit in. And I don't like that tone either with it. I could, like, 
whiffed it there. I know. That, oh, that's right in the way of the wardrobe and the door. Um, I want to use this in here, so I am going to try and make this work. So maybe if I can put it like under here. Let me just see. Nope, let's not cut into the wall, loves. Is that enough room to get in there? Absolutely not. So I'm going to meander everything around a little bit. I'm going to put the bookcase here. Maybe join it into the wardrobe there. That could be cute. We'll pop the mirror maybe there. We can pop the mirror. I'll sort out that shape in a sec. Let me just get this right first. Let's move you to there. You need your own moment because you're massive. But this is um, obviously Elvis's suit that he purchased at an auction. Or his mum got him. Yeah, Barbara got him that. Barbara got him that at, a, at an auction. Yeah, I think this might be okay. I don't like that in there now. Let's just meander everything over a little bit more. And then there, what I'm going to put is just a little... A little stool, one of those square cubes in a white to go in there. Stunning. Absolutely gorgeous. There for it, 100%. And up here, I think I'm going to just... Ah, oh, they had quite good pictures on this. I didn't realise the... I love some of the pictures. Maybe this can be from one of his mum's movies that he wrote the music for. <gasps> I'm there for it. This was the one I really liked. Maybe we can put that up there. That's kind of dominating now. I'm going to get rid of it. I know it kind of matches the theme, but I think it was dominating a bit too much. So maybe I'll do two of the kind of film poster ones. And they can be what his mum did, the musical store. This is the, the film with Kath, Kathleen Turner and Michael Douglas. It's called Romancing the Bone. <laughs> laughing at my own jokes again <sighs> what is this world coming to and then up here i think another mirror would suffice but maybe i could bring a bit more of that rose i know that's copper but maybe i could bring a bit more of that tone in here i don't like it actually a mirror there i'm not for it i'm not so i'm going to plop a plant up here and then do a photo a picture of hmm what can i put up there maybe one of these oh yeah we'll do two of these i'll pop one there i love that picture it's so gorgeous again maybe another film score that he's wrote the music for or something yeah he's a very successful musician i know he said he wasn't he was struggling but He's only struggling with the fact that he'll never be in the limelight. Just his work is the, the stuff that's going to speak to people. <laughs> okay, rug. Definitely need a rug in here. I'm thinking just a plain rug. I probably use this one. I know I use that to death, but I'm thinking that one would work in here really nicely. Unless I can get a big square one in. No. Or maybe a pop of yellow. We all know how much a yellow is coming on for me. Let's have a look at that. Oh, that's quite nice. Fits in here lovely as well. Maybe I could just tone it down. Oh, no. Oh, God. I forgot it was all like that. Oh, Christ. Oh, God, no. Yeah, I think I'm there for that one. I think I'm there. And maybe in here. Can we get a lamp up there? Oh, that doesn't make sense having a lamp in there. We'll just leave that free. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, we've done that. We're going to move on to the outside area. Okay, so I've just pulled out a grand piano. I think it looks nice in this corner here by the sliding door. Maybe people at the pool enjoy his renditions that he does for them. I like that idea. We did say we're going to put a canopy on. Um, it's very high though because it is medium height. But I'm going to see if it will work. Hopefully it will hopefully hopefully so i can maybe plonk this just above here whiffle that to there and to there oh yes yes i am there for it 
I think I'm going to do... Do I want to keep it in the wood? I think I do, but I'll change the direction of the wood. Oh, no, that way. Yes, I kind of, kind of enjoy that. And I could use this as well. And maybe even put a skylight there too. <gasps> yes! We are there for it, my friends. I am going to do a little privacy factor here, though, if I can, fi if I can find the right tone of the dividers. I forgot what I was saying halfway through then, and I remembered. Where are you? Hmm, have I gone past them? Where are you? Oh, in fact, what about if I can whiffle a couple of these up? Let's have a little look at the tones. Oh, grey, lovely. If I could like, there we go. I know it's leaving that weird line. Like there, but shh, shush. And then again there, look. Oh, that's not right up to the top. I do want it right up to the top. I won't lie to you. I do like a top. <laughs> uh, filth. Yes. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, I like that. That's very nice. And this, that's gave it, it's, oh God, sorry, I'm bouncing around. Let's get down to that level. That's gave it its own little like room moment going on. Oh, I don't mind that. I don't actually mind that. I thought that was going to be hideous. What I might do though. Is just put a few of these on in grey and just make it look like they're supposed to be there. Maybe I could just do two of these like there and there. Just balance you, my darling. There we go. Stunning. Yes, please. Yes, please. Here for it. Thank you. Um, Here, I'm feeling a dining area coming on. Maybe oh, I did say that they wouldn't entertain guests here. I did say that. So maybe just a smaller, a smaller factor. It will be fine. Oh, I'm sat on my legs. Very bad for your posture. Very, very, very bad. Um, I'm, I do want it to be kind of semi-classic back here. So I do want a few statues and stuff. I would imagine Barbara would want a water feature back here somewhere as well. So we're going to go ahead and do... In fact, I know what I'm going to do. Right, where's that door? Right, I can whiff that in a little bit more there. Here, I'm going to do a pond. I am. I bloody much am. Do I want it that big? Will it? Oh! Excuse, excuse you? Oh, it's not letting me. Oh. There's nothing there, you asshole. What about if I just... Nope, no, don't want to. Okay, well, you can go to hell. I hate the limitations of the pond tool. <sighs> I'm wishing that we can get a proper pond tool. Like, out of Planet Zoo and stuff, you know. And Sims 3. <sighs> Always revert, revert back to Sims 3. I do miss it so. Not the build mode, though. The build mode can do one. <laughs> I'm not a fan of the build mode. <laughs> I will, however, do a... Oh, this could work in here, actually. Oh, not that colour, though. Not with the wood. Um, oh, there we go. I will, however, be doing a one-off build in The Sims 3 soon, maybe, if you guys fancy it. Um, it will be an absolute, it will be an absolute shambles, though, because I haven't built in The Sims 3 for, God, I don't know how many years. Don't know how many years, but I'll do it. I'll do it for you, because you, my loves, are worth it. That's why. That is why. Right, we'll whiffle that a bit, a little bit more into the center now. And then I can just chuck this along a little bit more as well. Stunning. And we'll do the same as what we've been doing around the whole lot with these. I kind of enjoy that idea. And then again with the ivy. Just to break up that squareness a little bit. Oh, gorgeous. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, I'm feeling some mirrors coming on. I can feel it in my bones. So maybe I could put mirrors behind the fountain. Let's have a look. Let's have a goosey. What does that look like? That looks absolutely stupid. Uh, let's get one more, actually. And just put. I, I can feel mirrors in this place. Oh, we'll do them here. 
and one in the middle maybe no we'll put more flowers on there we'll put more flowers on there or some flowers at least at least i can't wait for those vertical gardens that are coming oh <gasps> i cannot wait i'm so excited for them i'm so excited yeah and then i'll climb a bit more of that ivy oh there we go just we'll size them down i oh, know in fact i'll start off with a big one giggity and just whiffle it up a bit like this that's all i'm gonna say oh god that's very tiny i can't see it Oh, it's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Right, so I need decorations for the garden in this place. Um, I'm just going to pull out a few bits. Going to pull out a few bits and we'll stop shuffling them and getting them around the garden. Okay, so I've just done this off of camera just so uh, we've got enough time today to fit everything that we need in. So I've pulled out a few statues, a few lanterns. Didn't know that you could put lanterns on a piano. I have no idea why I didn't know that. They would look great with a can. Oh, maybe we'll put a candelabra up there, actually. Oh, my God, I'm moist. Maybe we'll do that. I'm shocked at that, actually. I don't wish to comment on it. Is that floating? Nope, it's not. But we're going to change the colour. Oh, God. Yep, yeah, that one there, lovely. Oh, yes. Yes, he likes a bit of drama. Um, I've just added a few more little ivy pieces around. I've also gone and put this on the balcony area here. So I've used the bushes from Get to Work, I think they're from, and the base game bushes just to add a bit more privacy into this area again. Kind of hides that viewpoint from the street level, mainly because um, Barbara doesn't want to see every... Barbara doesn't want to see every... Barbara doesn't want everybody to see when she gets absolutely paralytic out on the balcony and she starts screaming at inanimate objects because she's just an angry, angry woman. Yes. But yeah, so yeah, little seating area, little bar area for them as well to come in. I kind of like that. That's kind of flowing really nicely and it's paying respect to the characters. I'm going to do the bathroom off of camera. I know I say that all the time and you guys understand by now. If it's not CC, I do not want to know. Anyway, let's try and map out this basement area. So I think this is the perfect entrance down a stairwell into the basement area because they have got access out this way. And as I said, there is staffed. So the cleaners would probably come down and do this. So this is what we're going to try and do now. Now, um, there to there this could be the stairwell let's see if we can fit some stairs in we should be able to okay and then i'm going to use the concrete ones or the stone ones even to there let's have a look and see what that opening's like oh i need them one closer i need them one closer like that and then we'll shuffle this down then let's have a look at that entry oh that's cool yeah i'm happy with that I am, however, going to put that white down there. Put that white down there and then get that brick and put it on the other sides. Like there, there. I'm thinking about maybe doing a half wall there. Yeah, I think a half wall would look better there than a, than a fence. Oh, it's going to get rid of all my wallpapers, isn't it? I can feel it in my bones. Please don't. No, no, don't get rid of my stairs. Oh. <sighs> Oh my god, we're lucky. And then, no, we we'll use the stone. We we'll use the stone on these bits. Boop, boop. Oh, it's the wrong height. It needs to be that height. Um, let's go back into half wall, half wall is it? And plonk you to there. That's better. And then I can use that trim up there. Oh, that's stunning. That's the perfect entrance there. Can we? Uh, can I get a trim? On that bit that's on there can we you bet not no absolutely not that is the wrong color stairs by the way I think we use these ones there we go yes that's perfect and then we'll do you down in this level this is gonna be the entrance to 
the air. Uh, is that good? Let me just have a look where this is going to lie. Oh, it's underground. It's fine. And this is the little, the little, uh, the little laundry room with a little staff room. I did say saunas, but maybe we'll do that next time. Maybe we can make a little sauna next time. An underground sauna. That could be stunning. We could do an underground sauna maybe and have like windows into the pool. <gasps> oh, I think I'm there for that. I do. I think I'm absolutely there for it. So that's the little staff area there. Let's get this place lit. Lit, my loves. Um, As all the kids are saying. Nobody says that these days. <laughs> or do they? I don't know. I don't know. I'm out of the loop. I'm out of the loop. Okay, so again, I need a staff looking door. So I might actually use the same ones as what we used up here on the laundry door. There we go. I'm going to do a... Mm, I would probably see it being tiles. I'd probably see this whole place being white tile because they have to keep, keep it epically clean. So if I can use them... And then I'll just do the white tiles that go with these. Is that the ones? That's the ones. Lovely. And again with a staff door there. This can be like a little utility cupboard or something. Yes. Okay. So there's four apartments. So we need one of each. One of each of the dryers and whatnot. Right. Appliances. Where are you? Come here. And... Are you in here? You're in here. That's the dryer. And this is the washing machine. I'm going to put the washing machines on one side, actually. Or shall I just put them above, on top of each other? I think I'll do that instead. Just have one size. And then I could even shorten the size of this down. Does that get rid of them? No, it just brings them closer. That's better. Oh, yeah, that's much better. Uh, dryer washer okay and then you up there my love one two three and four stunning stunning here for it there we go and okay maybe a few of those laundry carts and stuff as well just around here um and maybe just look at some, I won't do any laundry baskets down here because they'll keep filling up as the resident. Oh, that kind of makes sense, actually. <gasps> we won't put laundry baskets in the houses, in the apartments. We'll keep them down here because when the Sims get changed and stuff and their clothes come off, it will just automatically come down into this room. That's happening. I'm going to pull out loads of stuff. One second. Okay, so we pulled out a few bits and bobs. We're going to start placing them around now. I think just two of these would probably work okay. Um... We'll put that little empty shelf there. Just pretend that it's going to get... Because these don't snap on it for some reason. That annoys me. Do these? No. So what is the point of that shelf? What is the actual point of having a shelf that things don't go on? I would like to know. Answers below. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, we'll pop them up. We'll change the colour of you. I keep rising up because of the the floor level. Um, We'll pop you into a couple of purples there as well. Stunning. Up you go, darling. There we go. And I'll turn you just a little bit different so it looks a little bit natural. Stunning. They are probably poking out the bottom, but we're going to be okay. Everything's going to be fine. We'll plonk these towels on top of each other then. In fact, no, no, what I'll do is move this here. And plonk them on top. Like so. Some laundry. And maybe I could plonk you, size you down, and just plonk you on top there. Down again. There we go. And just maneuver them a little bit. Oh, natural. Love it. Love it. Yes. Here for it. Absolutely. I am going to do a smoke detector down here because you don't want a fire after setting fire to Barbara Smalls, do we? We'll pop you up there. We will do a whole sprinkler system and stuff in here too. Now, here my thoughts were just adding in a couple of those, like, industrial-looking sinks. Um, let's get rid of those filters. Where are you? Not them. These. Maybe just a couple of these. Not with a go to tap. There we go. 
just a couple in here. Just so they have got someone to do some hand washing in case that we've got delicates going on. Yes. And then maybe just a couple of storage cupboards at the top. I think that would be perfect. Ugh. Oh, I don't like those cupboards at all. I really don't. I just hate the colours of everything. I do. I hate them. Maybe I could use this one. And then they've got that plain swatch, haven't they? Where are you? There you are. I mean, that's okay. That's not too bad. We'll maneuver them a little bit closer together. It's just supposed to be a little stall cupboard anyway. It's not supposed to have much going on here. What I will put in here, however, is the full version of this one. Where are you? Oh, I'll just filter it. It's a lot easier. It really is. Um, Yeah, this one. But in the white. Oh, that was the white. One. Light. Light and not white. There we go. Yes. Uh, that's annoying me. Let me just put you there. I'm going to do a couple of these in here. In fact, I'm going to change those out for the... Um, oh, maybe you actually. Oh, yes, that's much better. Oh, yes, there we go, look. Okay, so they've got just the generic stuff. Laundry room with the entrance coming down from that way. I do enjoy that. It's a good place to have a staff entrance as well. Yes, okay. Yes, I think we're done. Just a few, obviously we, do, we still need to add a few little portraits and stuff of Barb and get the storyline flowing through a little bit better. But I think the Bond residence is complete. It's done. We're here for it. Yes. Yes to these queens. Let's play let's play them out. Let's let them live their dream. Let's get out of build mode. Um and let them live their dream in the sun. Look at them enjoying life. Oh, they're loving it. Loving it. Anyway, this is where this part is going to end today, my friends. We're going to be back tomorrow. We're going to be building the apartment up above this one. So this is going to be a bigger apartment to be all truthful. It's a three bed apartment. Now this is the place where the bachelor is going to live. But I'm thinking about doing a trio of bachelors. How would you feel about that? And I might make one of them a murderer to go along with that storyline that you guys were saying. Let's do it. Let's do a trio of bachelors. And we're going to make them the most sexiest sims you've ever seen in your life. I'm here for that. Anyway, I'm leaving you now. Thank you so much for your support. As always, you're amazing. I'm here for you. And I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye.